Immerse yourself in the serenity of wisdom, in the profound connection that transcends time and space. Welcome to the captivating world of Rumi's poetry and the luminous presence of Shams of Tabriz. Dive deep into the transformative power of their bond, uncovering timeless themes of love, unity, and divine presence. Venture into the heart of Rumi's work, where Shams is more than a teacher, he's a guiding light. Prepare to be captivated as we embark on Shams of Tabriz, the guiding light in Rumi's poetry. A poetic odyssey awaits you. Have you ever wondered how love can transform a person's life and their perspective on the world? That is the magic we will explore today as we journey into the life of Rumi, the celebrated poet, and his spiritual guide, Shams of Tabriz. Their divine encounter sparked a transformation in Rumi's poetry, infusing it with themes of love, unity, and divine presence. The narrative of their relationship reveals the profound transformative power of love. Join us as we delve into the fascinating world of Rumi and Shams. Let's embark on a journey back in time, to the 13th century, to meet Rumi, a celebrated poet, and Shams of Tabriz, his spiritual teacher. Born in what is now Afghanistan, Rumi was a scholar and a theologian. His life took a transformative turn when he met Shams, a wandering mystic, in the marketplace of Konya, Turkey. Shams was enigmatic and elusive, yet he held a magnetism that drew Rumi in. Their friendship was intense, with days and nights spent in spiritual discourse. Shams was not just a teacher to Rumi, he was a mirror that reflected the universe, a guiding light that led Rumi from the scholar's path to the path of the heart. Their relationship, however, was not without controversy. Shams was seen as a disruptive influence, leading Rumi away from his responsibilities. But for Rumi, Shams was a revelation, awakening in him a poetic voice that continues to resonate across centuries. Their meeting was not a chance encounter, but a divine collision that would forever change Rumi. The influence of Shams on Rumi was profound and far-reaching. Shams was not just a friend or mentor to Rumi, but a guiding light, leading him on a path of spiritual enlightenment. Their bond transcended the earthly realm. It was a divine connection that shaped Rumi's perspective on life and spirituality. Sham's teachings ignited in Rumi a deeper understanding of love, unity, and divine presence. These themes became the lifeblood of Rumi's poetry. Love, in Rumi's verses, is not merely an earthly emotion, but a divine force capable of transforming the soul. He saw unity not just as a societal ideal, but as a spiritual truth, underscoring our interconnectedness with the cosmos. In Rumi's poem, The Reed Flute Song, he writes, Listen to this reed how it complains, telling a tale of separations. This verse is a poignant example of how Rumi, under Sham's influence, uses the reed's tale of separation from its bed as a metaphor for the human soul's longing for unity with the divine. The presence of the divine is a recurring theme in Rumi's poetry. He viewed Shams as a symbol of this divine presence, a guiding light leading him towards spiritual enlightenment. In his poem, Only Breath, he writes, Not Christian or Jew or Muslim, not Hindu, Buddhist, Sufi or Zen, not any religion or cultural system, I belong to the Beloved. Here Rumi beautifully expresses the all-encompassing unity and love that transcends religious and cultural boundaries. Thus, through Shams, Rumi was able to experience and express the transformative power of love. Rumi and Sham's story continues to resonate with people across the globe, centuries after their time. Their tale is more than a historical account. It is a beacon of inspiration, a testament to the transformative power of love, unity, and spiritual growth. Their teachings, immortalized in Rumi's poetry, continue to touch the hearts of millions. People from all walks of life find solace in the words that flowed from Rumi's pen, words that were largely inspired by his divine connection with Shams. In our chaotic world, their teachings serve as a guiding light, reminding us of the importance of love and unity. They remind us that we are all interconnected, that our actions ripple out, affecting the whole. This understanding fosters compassion, empathy, and a sense of responsibility towards each other. Beyond the personal realm, their teachings also inspire communities. Rumi's poetry, imbued with the wisdom he gained from Shams, 
encourages us to transcend our differences and come together in unity. This message, though penned in the 13th century, is profoundly relevant in our diverse and interconnected world today. Furthermore, their teachings offer spiritual guidance. They invite us on a journey of self-discovery, prompting us to look within and connect with the divine presence in our hearts. This inward journey they teach is the path to true peace and fulfillment. The enduring legacy of Rumi and Shams extends to the arts as well. Rumi's poetry has influenced countless artists, musicians and writers, inspiring them to explore themes of love, unity and spirituality in their works. This artistic influence is a testament to the universal appeal and timeless relevance of their teachings. In the end, the story of Rumi and Shams is a testament to the transformative power of love and spiritual guidance. A message as relevant today as it was in the 13th century, 